When I was a little girl, my family loved to go to the beach on hot summer days. One such day, we drove to the ocean ready for a fun day in the surf. Instead, when we got there, we found the beach littered with rotting fish. Ever since, my family calls that the dead fish beach. But really, fish kills, as these are called, aren't localized to that one beach. It happens all over the world. But why does this happen? In part, because we use fertilizer on our crops. When it rains, these fertilizers wash off the plants, into the rivers, and then out into the ocean. There, instead of fertilizing the food we eat, these nutrients feed huge algae growths. When the algae die, the decomposition of their bodies uses up the oxygen in the water. This creates hypoxic conditions, meaning low oxygen. Unable to breathe, the fish die. I am studying how best to stop these nutrients from ever reaching the ocean. It's all about balancing trade-offs. Should the farm use less fertilizer? But then they will grow fewer crops. Should the farm put in systems to treat the water before it leaves their land? Again, this costs the farmers money. The answer is a nexus approach. By considering all the systems involved, water, energy, and food, we can move towards a more sustainable, economic future.